One day, while the Buddha was preaching his doctrine for the conversion of the world in the neighborhood of Savathi, a man of great wealth who suffered from many ailments came to him with clasped hands and said, O Lord Buddha, pardon me for my want of respect in not saluting you as I ought to, but I suffer greatly from obesity, excessive drowsiness, and many other complaints, so that I cannot even move without pain. The Tathagat, seeing the luxuries with which the man was surrounded, asked him, Have you a desire to know the cause of your ailments? And when the wealthy man expressed his willingness to learn, Buddha said, There are five things which produce the condition of which you complain. Opulent dinners, love of sleep, hankering after pleasure, thoughtlessness and lack of occupation. Exercise self-control at all your meals and take on yourself some duties. Duties that will exercise your abilities and make you useful to your fellow men. In following this advice, you will prolong your life. The rich man remembered the words of the Buddha and after some time, having recovered his likeness and youthfulness, he returned to the world-honored one. And coming this time without horses and luxuries, he said to him, Master, you have cured me of my bodily ailments. I come now to seek enlightenment of the mind. And Buddha once again said, The worldling nourishes his body, but the wise man nourishes his mind. He who indulges in the satisfaction of his appetite works his very own destruction, but he who walks in the path will have both. The salvation from evil and a prolongation of life. You see in life, if we only feed our body and our desires, what will become of us if you sleep too much, will walk around without any thoughts and just chase after pleasure, without being of any use to your community or your fellow men, what will become of you? If you are now just a small young root, what kind of tree will you become if you live this way? Always find the yin and the yang, the right amount of sleep, nourishment and usefulness. Enjoy life but also have an occupation. Have a meaning in your life. Set yourself some goals and always try to nourish your mind and grow in your mind so that you can understand what happens in this universe.